I came up with these two equations from a pre-calculus class, and I think they are really, really cool, so let's also do them together. You see that for the first one, we have an exponential equation, but the bases are different. And for the second one, we have a similar flavor, but it's just with logarithm instead, right? So how can we approach them? Well, as always, please pause the video and try them first. You did it? Good. Let's start with this one. First, I will have to tell you, not all exponential equations with different bases are easily solvable, but this one is. Why? Because I designed it. Well, of course, yeah, but like, this is the trick. Because when we have the 9 right here, look at that as 3 to the second power, and then to the x power, and this right here, add it with 3 to the x power, and we can move the 1 to the other side, like this. The whole key right here is that we have the 9, which is 3 squared, because this right here, we can rewrite it as 3 to the x power first, and then to the second power. And for this guy, I'm just going to put it as plus 3 to the x power, and then minus 1, and that's equal to 0. As you can see, this is actually a quadratic equation now, but it's just in terms of 3 to the x. Right? We have this to the second power, and this to the first power, and this term doesn't have that. So, we can continue to use the quadratic formula for this. And let me just emphasize that a is equal to 1, b is equal to 1, and c is equal to negative 1. Applying the quadratic formula, we know that we have 3 to the x power, and this is going to be equal to negative b, which is negative 1 like this, and then plus or minus square root of b squared minus 4ac, like so, and then all divided by 2a. Cool. Now, you will see that 3 to the x is always positive. So if you have negative here and negative here, that will give you a negative result, which is not possible. So we are going to rule out the negative here, and we will just get 3 to the x power, and that's going to be equal to negative 1, and then we just have the plus right here, and the square root. Here is just 1 plus 4, which is 5, and all over 2. Cool, and we're almost done. Because to get the x by itself, we just take log base 3 on both sides. And as you can see, this and that will cancel very nicely. So, ladies and gentlemen, we have x being equal to log base 3 of that, which is negative 1 plus square root of 5, all over 2, like this. Alright. And now for the second one, this right here is very doable because 9 is 3 squared, that's why. And some people might just want to do the exponentiation on both sides, but I prefer to show students with the change of base formula. So let's go ahead and take a look at this, and then rewrite it as log with base 10 of x, and then over log of 9. But we saw that earlier, 9 is the same as 3 squared. And the beauty of this is that we can bring the 2 to the front. And for the second one, we are going to rewrite it as log of x over log of 3. And of course, this is equal to 1. And you see, after we brought the 2 to the front, the bottom is just 2 times log 3. Right here, let's just go ahead and multiply it by 2 and multiply by 2 so that we can combine the fractions. And this is so nice because you see, this is just 1 log of x plus 2 log of x. Altogether, we have 3 log of x on the top. And then, on the bottom, of course, we have that denominator, like so. And then, of course, we can just multiply this on both sides. And we have 3 log of x is equal to 2 log of 3. Divide both sides by 3, we have log of x being equal to 2 over 3 log of 3. And then we can just bring this to here to make it into a power. So we are going to get log of x is equal to log of 3 raised to the 2 over 3 power. In the end, we can just do 10 to that power and 10 to that power, they cancel, meaning that x will be equal to that. So x equals 3 to the 2 over 3 power, and if you would like, you can work that out in the sense of the cube root, and then 3 to the second power is 9. Yeah, so x is equal to the cube root of 9 for this. Yeah, pretty cool, huh? So which one do you like more? Let me know.